Right, you take the first bite. Yummy, yummy, yummy. <laughs> Whoa! Hey guys, it's your girl Peggy Pizza here. Welcome back to my channel. Yay, it's pizza time. Okay, so today we're gonna eat Papa John's new Shakaroni pizza. Yeah, they collaborated with Shaquille O'Neal. And this is the box, it has a picture of Shaq. And this is their extra large 16 inch pizza with lots of pepperoni and extra cheese. And if you order this online, it comes down to $15, which I think is a really good deal for such a large pizza. Yummy, 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 yummy. That's my new neighbor. She talks really loud. Maybe I should put a sign outside that says filming in progress. Be quiet. <laughs> Okay, I actually started the video and then she started talking really loud, so I had to restart again. Okay, so let's just try this again. Take two! Woo! Okay. <laughs> yeah, so I dip it in the ranch. Ooh, here, let's dip it again. Here we go. Right, you take the first bite. Nimmy, nimmy, nimmy. Mmm. <laughs> Mmm. Wow. Mmm. You know what? This is pretty good. The crust is kind of thick though. Have you tried Shaq's pizza? I don't remember the last time I had Papa John's. Ooh. Mm. Let's dip it in the special garlic sauce. How generous. How is this enough for the whole pizza? Mmm. Mmm. Oh my, this is good. You should give like at least three for this pizza. Yeah, so my new neighbor, she has a really big dog, and um, sometimes the dog will keep barking. And sometimes she talks pretty loud. <laughs> I'm sure you can hear her earlier. Yeah. Mm. Do you guys have any loud neighbors? Not just friendly though. I'm a little afraid of a dog. It's like a really big uh, German Shepherd, I think. Mmm. Alright. 
Oh. This is a really big pizza. Wow. All right. Ooh, here's some Pepsi. Here's to Shaquille O'Neal and Loud Neighbors. Mm. <coughs> ah. <coughs> Whew, this is good. You know, the funny thing is when I went to order this, I want it to be cut into six slices so that each slice is bigger. And then the, the guy was like, oh, no, sorry, we can only cut it in eight. And I was like, can you cut it in six? Then he said, no, it has to be cut in eight. <laughs> so I told him, okay, uh, don't cut the pizza. I'll just cut it myself. <laughs> I don't get it. Why, why can't he cut it in eight? <laughs> Did his manager be like, okay, you have to cut it in eight. If you cut it in six, I'll fire you or something. Like, well, why can't he cut it in eight? This last work for him. Or did Shaq specifically, specifically said, no, my Shaq pizza has to be in eight slices. If you cut it in six, I'll sue you or something. Anyone here worked in pizza places? Is there a really strict rule on how many slices you must cut a pizza? Like if you cut it, it has to be eight. You can't cut it in four, you can't cut it in six. It has to be eight or you violate the rules. Is that such a thing? And speaking of cutting pizza, that's one time I ordered a um, pizza from Costco, a whole pizza. And they cut it in really, really thin slices. I'll put a picture here. Have you guys seen that? Is that how they usually cut it? And I was like, um, can you not do that? <laughs> I had to make them, you know, make a new one because I'm doing it for the video. And it's weird to have like really thin slices. I don't know, it's just weird that they cut it in such a thin slice. And a guy was like, oh, this is how we usually cut it. Yeah, and um, for Costco, it sucks that you need a membership to order food from the food court now, right? Before, they allow you to buy food from the food court without a membership. Now you have to, you know, get a membership to get a pizza and hot dogs. That sucks, though. I mean, why? The food court is outside, you know? They should be able to let anyone buy the food.
I miss Costco's hot dogs. I think the hot dogs is the best. But only if you eat it there though. Once you bring it home and it's cold, it's not as good. You, you have to eat it right there at Costco. Oh, all right. <laughs> Excuse me. All right, here. You take the first bite. Ooh. Mm. So are you a Costco member? Can I borrow your membership to buy Costco's hot dogs? Mm. Oh, are you a member of what's the other place? Sam's Club? I've never been to a Sam's. What do you like to get at Costco? I mean, the food wise. Well, obviously, the roast chicken is like, that's the best. For me, it's the roast chicken and the hot dogs, really. Those are the two things that. I always get at Costco, so it's not really worth the membership just to get the hot dogs and roast chicken. You know, they should like sell some kind of a day pass, you know, for Costco, right? Like you just pay 10 bucks for this day pass and you can go in for one day and buy whatever you want. It makes sense, right? Remember when the zombie apocalypse started? Everyone went crazy with the toilet paper at Costco.
this is a decent pizza. I mean, it's not horrible. <laughs> it's alright. It's, it's not a hallelujah pizza, you know. Ah. Can you hear it? My neighbor just started her shower. Can you hear the pipe sound? Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. This is why I want her shower schedule. You know, I want to know exactly when she wants to shower. <laughs> so I can avoid the timing, you know. You know, this pizza is really big, but when Shaq holds the pizza with his giant hands, it just looks like a regular sized pizza. How tall is Shaq? Like 10 feet? <laughs> Anyone here seen Shaq in person? I, I think that would be really impressive. Like, like <laughs> he plays basketball, right? Okay, I know this sounds really stupid, but I'm not really into sports, so I don't really know who is who in the sports world. But I'm gonna say he plays basketball. Yeah, I think it's basketball, right? I have no idea about sports or anything. Are you guys into sports? Super Bowl, football, I don't know, to you guys football, I don't know, to me football is soccer, like in Singapore, football is soccer, but over here is the football thing. <laughs> Yeah, so it seems like now is um, some sports season. Every time I walk by a bar, a sports bar, you see a lot of people standing outside, cheering, you know, watching the TV.
I thought I heard my neighbor again. Yeah, I, I should consider putting a sign out there, you know, filming in progress. Tell my neighbors, please refrain from showering, no dog barking, no using vibrators, you know. I don't know what she's doing over there, my neighbor here. Sometimes there'll be like a buzzing sound, like really loud. Yeah, don't, don't ask me what she's doing. It's just, just really loud buzzing sound, like zzzz, you know. I don't know, maybe it's a massage chair, you know, or one of those massager things, right? It could be anything. What are you thinking of? I don't know, I'm hearing something, so hopefully she didn't turn on any buzzing sound. Yeah, so I would say this Papa's on, Papa John's pizza is like a... It's like the same level with Pizza Hut, Domino's, Little Caesars, you know. It's like they're all the same level. I noticed that when I went to New York in the Manhattan area, I've never ever seen a Pizza Hut, Little Caesars, Domino's, or Papa John's, or Pizza Hut, you know. I never see one fast food pizza place there. Well, obviously, there's so many good pizza places there that all these, you know, chain pizzas are not going to do well. I mean, if you have a choice between a New York style pizza, like a real New York, or a Papa John's, you choose the New York. Right? Excuse me.
You think Shaq himself can finish this whole pizza? Well, yeah, I think he can. To him, this is like a personal small pizza. He can probably eat like three of them. You know, the crust gets a little hard. You know, they should make a pizza that is like a crustless pizza. Is there such a thing? <laughs> well, Little Caesar's pizza, the thin crust one is kind of crustless, you know, there's no edge. Right, all the topping just goes all the way to the edge, so it's like there's no crust. Ah! Oh. Yeah, so what are you guys up to? <coughs> what are you guys doing for Halloween? Are you guys doing anything fun? It doesn't really feel like Halloween this year for some reason. Do you guys feel that? I don't know, it's like, maybe there's a lot going on at the moment, so it, you know, it kind of doesn't feel very festive. With all the crazy things happening right now. Yeah, that must be it. Okay, this garlic butter thing is really good, but it's also very greasy. Wow. This is like a whole tub of grease. It's butter, right? Special garlic dipping sauce. Yeah, I think it's mostly butter. Yeah.
Now it sounds like my neighbor decided to not shower. Maybe she heard me talking. I'm hearing some helicopters. Now, every time I hear a helicopter, I think there's a car chase going on. Why are there so many car chases here? I don't know about other places, but here in California, like every, every other day, you see a car chase. I'm from Singapore. My whole life in Singapore, I've never seen a car chase. Not on TV, ever. But then again, Singapore is really small and our roads are not as uh, long and as long as here. So there's hardly any space for you to chase. But yeah, I've never actually seen a car chase in Singapore. And then when I come here, it's every two days. Do you guys watch car chases? Oh god! Yeah, the last point! <clears throat> and done! <clears throat> All right, so the whole shakaroni pizza took me 34 minutes, 32 seconds. And just in time, I just heard my cleaning lady start at a vacuum. <laughs> Lots of things happening today. All right, so the shack pizza, it is 16 inch, and if you order online, it's $15. If you go to the store to order, for some reason, you don't get the discount. So you have to order it online to get that uh, deal. And it's a pretty decent pizza. I mean, it's not a hallelujah type pizza, you know what I mean? It's good enough pizza. Yeah, that's how I would describe it. A good enough pizza. <laughs> and there's a lot of pepperoni. Uh, the crust is pretty tasteless. <laughs> there's no flavor to it really. But for the size 16 inch, $15. It's a good deal. And in case you missed it earlier, when I went to Papa John's to uh, order the pizza, 
I told him that I wanted it to be cut into six pieces and he said no I, I it has to be cut in eight and I said can you cut it in six he says no it, it has to be eight pieces it has to be cut in eight pieces you know in a really serious way so I told him well I'll I'll just cut it myself don't cut it so I don't know it just seems really weird to me that it has to be eight pieces <laughs> like why is it because they put it through some kind of automatic cutter that has to be eight or he just can't like I don't know is there some kind of rule that you have to cut in eight otherwise you get fired or something I don't know it's just really weird I mean who cares how many slices I want to be cut right well anyway thank you so much for joining me in today's shakaroni pizza feel free to let me know what other uh, food you guys will let me eat for you let me know down in the comments and be sure to subscribe so you see more awesome food challenges mukbangs like this yeah so I'll see you all in my next video click on here 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 or here I'll see you in the next one